You know what time it is, Geek Gang, and it's time to get sauced up with another Hajime no Ippo reaction. We are finishing season two. Brian Hawk was just defeated by Takamura-san. My man is the world champ. What a crazy fight. If you guys didn't catch that super reaction, it was like four or five episodes back to back. Make sure you guys check that out. Um, and also, I will be continuing this. I'm not sure how many more seasons of Ippo are there. Can you please let me know in the comments? Um, again, if you guys want to catch it early, unedited, description box, check out the Patreon. Um, and if you want to come back, I do watch Epo twice a week here on the channel. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. But are you guys ready? Let's get this thing popping, bro. Let's see how this shit ends up. How does this finalize? We got two more episodes, cuh. Yeah, you the champ, bro. My man went plus ultra on that ass. <laughs> Ha Where's Miata? As Miata usually does. Yeah. <laughs> Super cool. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> all right. All right. Well, hey, I'll give all these ladies. <laughs> oh, so Takamura, bro. Yeah, bro, he got, he was max maxed. I mean, yeah. He's been doing this way longer, bro. <clears throat> Now he ordered himself. Ha <laughs> 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 Oh, we're getting mugged. Shut up. Nah. <laughs> nah. <laughs> My man, he like. <laughs> yeah. Not a cheap world champion. <laughs> he gonna fuck you up. Not a sparring partner. Oh, nah. 
No less for 50. This motherfucker was like, you broke my shit? Well, guess what? You're gonna be selling all these for 50. <laughs> Ooh. Nice. Sharp. It's over. Yatta! He got all them bitches. So he's like, <laughs> he hype. Yay! <laughs> Mm. Or should be huge. Mm. Interesting. So he got that determination. He's like, fuck, I'm gonna do whatever it takes. <laughs> Not, oh, snap. I'm home, my homies. Nah, not the dramatic walking in the in the wind. Nah. <laughs> nah. I'm not gonna lie. I would be. I'd. I'd feel some kind of way too. I'd be like. <sighs> Not the Matrix. <clears throat> Not Epo took his first step. These fucking dad jokes are so... I can't. I can't with that type of shit. I'd be like, nah. Nah, not the idiot father. I can't. Yeah, I've never been a dad joke laugher. Like, uh, corny joke. I don't like corny. So anything corny, it just turns me off, which is why I can't do musicals. I can't, like, there's certain things that I'm just like, nah, it just, it, it doesn't do it for me. Dad jokes are one of those things. I'm like, mm. we got here. Is Miata? <laughs> Did we get a response? Look at him, bro. He like, all of them are <laughs> same as usual. <laughs> I love it because they're like, man, you really don't like bringing any hype to the studio, bro. You need to work on your people skills. Oh wow. <clears throat> oh chill. Nah. <laughs> Man, I was like, yeah. <laughs> no, no. 
Yep, he's there. Why you dodging me, homie? Why you dodging me, son? Yo, I said, why you? What? So the Pacific Tile's not big enough, bro? What? What? What, what you talking about? What? What is this, bro? Is it, I'm not. I'm not your level right now. What's up? Oh shit. Ooh. Oh. Yo, he don't even know. Oh, he like, bro, I've been sending, I've been sending requests and you've been dodging me, bro. What's up? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. You don't know. Oh, shit. He's going to, Epo's going to be pissed, bro. Yo, he's mad. He's gonna be like, cause he'll beat you. Watch him be like, cause you ain't ready. Ooh. He said, watch your damn mouth, bro. Who you talking to? Ooh. You know, it's crazy though. Here's the thing, bro. Just because, just because Ippo is the champ, right? He beat certain people to get the belt, right? Certain people that he was stronger than that worked in his benefit, right? Is one thing. But Miyata has so much more experience, bro. He has so, I've been saying this the whole time. Like the, the story keeps showcasing Ippo as this, you know, guy that keeps overcoming his, his obstacles. You know what I'm saying? And, and that's, what drives you to really want to be invested in the character, but it help it almost it uh, it almost uh, hides the fact that Epo is still only a couple years in. Period. Like full stop. Not a couple years in as a pro. A couple years in. Full stop. Which means Miata has years before he even became a pro of experience and technical skill. Right. So while optically to the rest of the world, y'all may seem like you're holding similar title levels. He's like, but that don't mean shit, bro. <laughs> oh! Look at his shit, bro. Oh! He was like, oh, so you at your peak now. Fuck are you, bro. Like you just started. Oh, talk your shit, Chief, bro. Let's go. Mm. And it's one of those things. Remember, he was saying uh, when he was looking at. When Ippo was standing outside of the gym when Miyata was fighting Date, when they were sparring, and how Miyata, even did, uh, what's his name, uh, Date was saying, the reason why he was sparring him is because he's the closest thing to Martinez as far as like how he strikes. And he was just, nope, nope, nope. And you saw how Martinez just picked off the Dempsey roll, no problem, like with ease. So he's telling the truth, like, look, bro, like, that works on these type of opponents that you fought. It's not going to work on this type of a fighter, bro. This type of a technical fighter that got the speed, he going to pick you off. Mm. Mm. 
体調がいいほど差があるいい勝負ってのはどこだうんいいよ、ね、俺は俺の So he's leaning super heavy into that. Look at Takamura. He's not impressed, bro. Everybody else is impressed except for Takamura. He's like, this ain't it. Look at it. Boy, he's like, he stopped it with the quickness, bro. And Ipo was like, oh, fuck, what? Right. There's a balance. So once you exceed, so once you exceed a certain threshold, the punches become light because you're trying to move so quickly. So that's interesting. There's a point of diminishing returns, is what he's saying. I need to prepare myself as well. Oh, chill. What I say, bro? It's the same shit that Ricardo Martinez did, bro. Mm. Interesting, okay. So I wonder if there's gonna be anything where he's utilizing jabs in this role of some sort. Because right now he's looking on balance and speed. Hey, he's like looking at him like, hey, he's. <clears throat> awesome. Awesome. Season two is a wrap. Great season. Loved every minute of it. Uh, I think the this situation here is so good because it's like, yeah, you've gotten this far with the particular move set. However, just because you have a move doesn't mean it works for everybody, right? This and it's so dope because you know, in in the nerd culture, we do things called power scaling, right? Well, if you beat this person. And I've beat that person. Uh, if you lost to that person and I beat that person, that means I could beat you. A lot of times in comic books and anime and things like that, scaling like that works, right? Well, in this, it doesn't work that way. Not as much in comics, but definitely a lot in anime like Dragon Ball, Naruto, things like that, where there isn't like your level of power is usually your speed level as well. You know, what you know what I'm saying? Like, whereas in real world, it's not like that. Right, where you can have somebody like uh, somebody that's particularly powerful, like Epo, fight a person and and lose, right? But then this person goes and and loses to another guy, but then Epo fights this guy and beats him because the skill sets just match up properly, right? Like it, it's just it's it's 
more strategy and trying to figure out what the best matches will be. Not necessarily like, oh, well, because I got this super move, it works on everybody. Like, no, that's not how that works. And also, if you're out in the limelight all the time, people can see they have more tape, they have more footage of you. It's easy to build a defense against said thing, which is why sports have, you know, you look at and review tape after games. Like, okay, cool. Or you see, oh yeah, I'm going up against uh, this team. Let's go review some tape and see what plays they run, how their point guard, you know, operates X, Y, and Z. You know what I'm saying? Like, those are the types of things that you have to do in real life and strategy, right? It's not like, oh, well, this person is always going to be the best because he has the best this. It's like, well, no, that's, that's not how it works. You know what I'm saying? Because if somebody's defense is up is is super strong and can counter that type of an attack then what you know so really really dope let me know your guys thoughts man on epo season two how you guys feel about it i absolutely loved it i cannot wait to get into the next season of this how many seasons are there please let me know um and again if you guys want to catch the next reaction to epo make sure you guys hit that subscribe button i do watch this twice a week so there should be another one coming up you know what i'm saying so don't miss that uh but if you guys want to catch it a week early Link in the description box. So that's Atron, Katron, Blatron. Other than that, I will catch you guys in the next one. Geek A. We out this thing.